A new study released today shows among nearly 10,000 enlisted soldiers who have attempted suicide and more than one-third had no prior mental health diagnosis. Now, many of the risk factors happen while the men and women are serving our country. The now is Connor Wist. He is live in the newsroom with why supportive services right now for veterans has never been more important. Connor? That's right, Shannon. Every month, hundreds of veterans are transitioning from serving our country to finding where they will serve next as members of Colorado communities. And that's why supportive services during the transition are extremely important for when service members return home. We sometimes get them at their most challenging stage. 20,000. That's the number of veterans, military members, and their families Mount Carmel Veterans Service Center has supported over the years. Each month we're transitioning around 400 service members. Fort Carson's Transition Assistance, or TAP program, helps bridge the gap into civilian life after service. Whether it be resume prep, whether it be connecting with other employers, or just assisting them with their financial needs and helping them get on the right track towards success. The program connects service members with community partners, like Prep Connect 360. And the next question is, and now what? What do I want to do next? The free week-long transition assistance workshop has already served more than 550 service members and families. Vicki Murray being one of them. It's so empowering to know I can do what I want to do now. Fort Carson also makes the connection with higher education opportunities, like at Pikes Peak Community College. The trick is figuring out what I need to do to fill in the gaps so that I can be as successful as I can be on the outside. And education for a lot of people and a lot of veterans is does exactly that. Pikes Peak also connects students who have served with places like Mount Carmel, where the journey can continue into careers with mock interviews and networking opportunities. And there's a high demand for their skill set. We want to be on the front lines of that and capture that first before anyone else does. To learn more about any of these programs or to schedule a visit with Mount Carmel, you can call them or visit the Mount Carmel site. We have a link to all of that information on our website, thedenverchannel.com. In the newsroom, I'm Connor West for the Now Denver. Thank you.